hey guys and welcome to my channel and welcome back if you've been here before how are you doing today i'm gonna be putting on a half wig for the first time i'm gonna show you the wig this is the wig this is the outre stunna wig it's so fucking cute and it also has like a yakky texture so hopefully it'll look more natural with my hair my hair is black box dyed literally i black box dyed it so that i could like buy cheap wigs and it matches better but Hopefully it looks cute. It's so fucking extra though. Like, I don't know, like, like, where am I wearing this? You know what I mean? Well, anywhere, literally anywhere, whatever. But let's get started. Okay, this is what my hair looks like. I had it braided because um, I was wearing wigs for a little bit and I'm going to wear another one, but I wore it out to work today. So I don't know. It's kind of tangled because I wore it out, but also I'm my dumb fucking ass. I bought these press-ons from Amazon. Hold on. Can you see? I wish you could see it better. There you go. They, they look like that, but I don't have a freaking nail file. And also, these press-ons are big as shit, and they don't want- They don't have a size for my pinky. Come on. Are you kidding me? So I have to get a nail file so that I can file one of these big-ass ones. And look, they even have, like, these tabs and shit. Like, I just- It's too much. Like, I should have just got stuck with the French tip. I want it to be a little extra, and I did this, and now I regret it. But- it is what it is so i have to part my hair i watched so many half wig like tutorial videos before this so actually i don't know if i want to side part it i think i want to side part it look this is what it looks like like oh my god so cute okay yeah i think i'm gonna side part it I also lost my freaking rat tooth comb so i have to use a pick to do everything and i'm just like not in my element right now dude okay and then i'm gonna put like i guess like a barrier like this amount of hair like around my what's it called maybe i should do a little less around my hairline just so you don't like see the wig when like wind blows and shit like that ah fuck a nail popped off i'm so I'm so tired of press-ons, but I do not have the fun. I mean, I do have the funds. I'm just cheap as fuck. Like, I just don't want to pay to get my nails done all the time. Like, it's a good chunk of change, you know? And, like, I'm trying to save and all that shit because I'm trying to move out. But, like, it costs <laughs> so much to be a bad bitch. Like, let me fucking tell you, like, you want to get waxed you want to get your nails done you want to get your eyebrows done you want to get your lashes done you want to get your hair done you want to get a tan you want to do all this all that you want to get facials you want to get massages like this shit it's a lifestyle that like most of us seriously cannot afford like being a broke bad bitch is actually so hard like i couldn't even tell you the half Okay, I'm gonna braid this and then I'm gonna like loosely braid the back because the wig is actually like pretty big I'll show you the cap size in a second But like good thing is I don't have to like do tight ass cornrows for it to fit because some of my I hate tight wigs This looks so fucking stupid, but I hate tight wigs Look, this is the cap size and for half of your head not really half but like Pretty good, you know what I mean, but now I'm thinking like I think I'm parting wrong because like Hmm. Let me see. Let me put the rest of my hair in a bun and then put this thing on and see. Because I feel like the way that I'm parting my hair, I'm like parting it for like a sew-in. Like these are not tracks. Like I, re I need to realize that I, uh, I can't part it like this. Hold on. Oh, but this is going to be so cute. Look. Mm -mm. Okay, and TBH, I feel like I can literally just put my hair in a bun and put this on. Like, I'm trying to do minimum effort, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, I'm tired of doing all the shenanigans. And I'm going to tie a tight-ass bun. Okay, period. Da -da 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 da 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 Let me try it on, make sure it fits before I do all the straightening. I should cut out the, what's it called? The tag, duh. 
Oh, I can show you the tag. This is the tag. I got it in 1B. Cute. I forget how much this wig was, but it wasn't that much. I got it on uh, Amazon just so I could keep track of shipping and shit. But I know if you get it on like Sammy something like dot com, like you can get it for I think like 20 bucks. I paid more than 20 bucks though for sure. Oh, yay. Good. It fits. Isn't that great that the cap size and I have a big head that it's big enough so that you don't even need to braid it. This hair is so cute. Oh my god. Ugh. I literally want to leave it on while I do this shit because it makes me feel like a girl. Like I just feel like such a girl right now. This is literally a freaking dread. Like, let's take this out. Let me put my books down. <laughs> I was thinking I might have to blow dry it, but since I combed it out so much, like, maybe I don't even have to blow dry this shit that ass. Let me see. All right, I'm going to use my Revlon brush or blow dryer brush or whatever. Usually when I straighten my hair, I need to make a straightening hair video because I do like my, my Marilyn Monroe curls pretty often. And anytime I post like a TikTok with that, somebody asked me for a tutorial and I'm just so lazy because that hair takes literally so much effort. Sorry, I'm plugging in my thingy. But like that hair <laughs> takes so much fucking effort because you have to wash your hair and then you have to braid your hair so that the curls stretch, that you're not starting from tight curls because then it takes even longer and then you have to wait for the curls to semi dry and that or the, the braids to semi dry then you take out the braid one by one and I usually do about six of them and then you go in with the hair dryer the brush and then you do this the Revlon brush and then you straighten it and then you put curlers in and then you sleep with it overnight hopefully two days if you plan in a, planning ahead because the curls last longer if you do it for two days and then you get the curls like girl it takes so much motherfucking work like sometimes i just don't have the effort like i just i don't want to do that okay i'm gonna go through this section first with this thing and then i'll come back when i'm straightening i wish this made more noise I had these bangles that were literally stuck on my wrist and my mother gave them to me and she told me like if you put them on they're gonna get stuck on your wrist and I was like okay period but I want bangles all the time two days in I had to rip them off and I literally like almost broke a hand bone like anytime I I think also mind you my nails are such an issue but this hand is bigger than this hand and I had them on this hand and I could like feel my hand bone shifting anytime I took the bracelets off but they would come off I put them on this hand one day bitch it was done Two days later, I was like, yeah, trying to take that shit off, but it worked. I am so stupid for putting this wig on while I'm trying to straighten my hair, but because it keeps getting tangled all up in the, what's it called? All up in my hair when I'm trying to straighten this shit, but I didn't have to blow out my hair, which I'm so happy about because that shit is so annoying and I hate how loud the blow dryer is. So I'm basically done with the Revlon thing. I just use this to get out any kinks and then this makes it like smooth or not really kinks but just like because we're not supposed to use that word right um like waviness i'm trying to get out any waviness because you know sometimes when you straighten your hair and you're being lazy it's straight for sure but like you can still see like you can still see here like the waves in my hair like I'm trying to get that out you know what i mean the only thing i'm worried about is that i'm gonna have to curl it so maybe i put in rollers for a little bit i don't know I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna put in these rollers until I'm done curling it. Look, see, like the hair is getting mixed in. Okay, and I guess I'm gonna just put this piece of hair that got in with it from the wig. Curl this up. And I ordered food, so I'm gonna eat Domino's. <laughs> and then when I'm done with my Domino's, I'll take out the curlers. You know when you just get tired of yourself looking like a bum? Like, that's why I need to just slap this shit on. Because, like, under this shit, my hair looks crazy. And I'm, like, not trying to see that. Like, I don't know. Relatable? <laughs> With this wig, I'm trying to go, like, full Hannah Dasher. Like, I was going to... So, I'm obsessed with Dolly Parton. That's, like, like, been new. But, like... I just love the whole, like, country cutie aesthetic. Like, I just think it's so cute. Like, 
the bigger the hair the better and like that's what I want to give like I want to start wearing like western cut cowgirl shirts because they're like tight and like booby but cute but with like low rise jeans and like this hair and like flip flops like I just think it's cute like I don't know I just like all the extraness and I hope like I really freaking hope like I get some plans oh I do have plans tomorrow and I forgot so period I have plans it's a little cute for tomorrow <laughs> it's gonna look so cute oh my god okay I'm gonna go through everything with this and then I'll be back okay y'all so I'm gonna take out the curlers now and I tried to like take off the wig to what's it called to get this part this section but like I put some of the curlers in there and I think maybe now I can do it actually okay yeah since I took all the curlers out because some of the hair was blended in with the curlers when I put them in like some of the wig hair so maybe I'm gonna just take oh yeah literally I can just take this section of my hair and just straighten it real quick I look crazy right now but watch and see it's gonna look really cute in like two seconds there's a clip in the front and there's a clip in the back okay and I'm gonna take this out oh my god <gasps> Oh my god. Okay, this I need to fix, but I'm gonna do a side part anyway. <gasps> Wait, dude, this is so fucking cute. <gasps> Bitch. Okay, wait. Let me try to like side part the wig, maybe. There we go. Oh my god. There we go. The only thing I'm like trying to figure out is like what to do with this piece in the front, but it doesn't look bad. Oh my god. I love it. It's literally so cute. And there's still hair in the back. But I can like move less to the back. And I like kind of like the bump moment going on here. Okay, y'all. So this is the finished hair as of right now <laughs> it's so fucking cute i was gonna do my makeup but like it's late and i don't feel like i feel like doing my makeup but i don't feel like taking it off and i know that's gonna be a pain in my ass so i'm not gonna do it and i'm gonna wear this tomorrow anyway so if you want to see like full mug follow me on instagram follow me on tiktok all are in my description but i think they're both the same as my username here, Mecca Maraschino, um, with a dot in between the two names. But ah, I do need to get this part straighter because it's a little textured. I've had this in for about like two hours now. But like once I get this shit straight, <laughs> it's over for you bitches. At the end of the day, just keep your man inside because I will be coming outside. And I fear for you and your relationship at this point. I'm really sorry because once you see these girls, once you see this little beat me up Scotty look, he not going to know what to do. <laughs> okay. Okay, y'all. So I will see you in my next video. And I hope you have a great day. Bye.